Your voice, your vote. Multiple media outlets tonight reporting that President Donald Trump made disparaging comments about America's fallen troops, including calling U.S. Marines killed in World War I, quote, losers and suckers. The reports are spawning nationwide outrage. The president vigorously denies them. Eyewitness News reporter Jory Rand live now with more. Jory. Mark, four years ago, the Access Hollywood tape dropped on October 7th. This time around, it's a month earlier, but this story could have a lasting impact. Also, unlike last time around, as of tonight, there is no tape of this incident, and the president is denying the entire story. You can call it a September surprise. The Atlantic Magazine reporting tonight that back in 2018, President Trump called fallen U.S. soldiers losers and suckers for getting killed in action. The article citing four people with firsthand knowledge of the situation and tonight both the AP and Washington Post confirming the story. I serve on active duty in the military and I find it absolutely disgraceful for anyone to think that Americans who gave their lives in service to our nation are somehow losers or suckers. Los Angeles Congressman Ted Lieu, a veteran who still serves in the Air Force Reserve, outraged. It is completely unacceptable when these words come from the mouth of the commander in chief, and I call on Donald Trump to immediately apologize. Family members of the fallen reacting on social media tonight. One apparent California woman writing, this is my grandfather. He was a Marine who took machine gun fire at Below Wood. He was honored by his country and by the people of France. Donald Trump just called him a loser for being wounded in action. And John listed as being from Orange County writing, my grandfather lost at sea in World War II. Trump wondered what was in it for him. Tonight, the president returning from a rally in Pennsylvania, denying the story in its entirety from the tarmac of Joint Base Andrews. And I would be willing to swear on anything that I never said that about our fallen heroes. There is nobody that respects them more. What animal would say such a thing? Back in 2015, then-candidate Donald Trump said this about then-Senator John McCain, who was a prisoner of war for five years in Vietnam. He's not a war hero. He's a war hero. He's a war five hero. and a half years. He's a war hero because he was captured. I like people that weren't captured, okay? The president's opponent, former Vice President Joe Biden, whose late son Bo was a member of the Army, hitting the president on a number of fronts while speaking in Kenosha, Wisconsin. The words of a president matter. No matter if they're good, bad, or indifferent, they matter. So this story turning into one of those who do you believe stories. The former body man for President Trump tweeting tonight he was with the president the entire day two years ago and never heard the president say anything like this. But the AP talked to a current senior Defense Department official who confirmed the entire story. The Washington Post speaking with a former senior administration official with President Trump who said the president frequently disparaged the military, veterans, and current soldiers, and did hear him call them losers. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.